Good morning and welcome to the Taz Morning Show. I'm Flora and here are the latest updates from Oman. Ministry of Heritage and Tourism will officially open the Oman Adventure Center and launch the world's longest zip line over water on Wednesday, April 22nd in the Musandam Governorate. The zipline project is the first activity of the center which is being developed as a part of comprehensive development plan for the region. Oman Adventure Center aims to diversify Musandam's tourism market by providing a wide variety of quality products and experiences. The center will accommodate a broad range of facilities providing visitors with an integrated tourism experience. It comprises a dedicated waiting area and several other facilities. Guests wanting to experience the zip line can visit the Oman Adventure Center from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. during the weekdays including the weekends and official holidays. Oman's GDP at current prices exceeds Omani Real 44 billion. As per the data issued by the National Center for Statistics and Information in the second edition of its quarterly National Accounts Indicators report, this increase is mainly due to the rise in the growth rate of oil activities. It increased by 10.2% at constant prices compared to the same period in 2021. In addition to that, mining and quarrying activities also witnessed an increase of 10.5% growth rate from the year 2022. The Salala Free Zone Company, a subsidiary of the ASEAD Group, signed an agreement to establish ferrosilicon and packaging paper production plant. The project is being built on an area of 300,000 square meters with an investment size of 88.5 million Omani Real. The production capacity of the project in its first phase is scheduled to reach about 90,000 tons of ferrosilicon alloys annually, to be doubled in the second phase to reach about 180,000 tons annually. The production capacity of recycled wrapping paper in the first phase is about 300,000 tons annually. Thank you for watching the Taz Morning Show. Follow the Arabian Stories for the latest updates.